everybody and welcome back to another video of LSPDFR. We are going to be switching it up today and we are going to be doing a patrol in Blaine County. Uh, we are going to be using a CVPI today. We're going to, it's all blues. Uh, I think they look really awesome. So we're going to go ahead and get out on patrol and see what we can't get into. Dispatch calling unit 3, Charles 2. We have a traffic alert for an armored car robbery. We're going to go ahead and take this uh, ANPR hit for a armored car robbery. I'm going to go ahead and flip around here. It looks like they're going to be on the highway, so we're going to be a little out of our jurisdiction. Let's go ahead and, go ahead and get through that intersection and uh, get onto the highway. Uh, they might be... It looks like they might be taking Union Road. Anyways, we'll go ahead and uh, see if we can't catch up. Keep an eye on where they're going. And for those of you who are wondering, I did switch over to the Code 3 Mastercom B uh, in the modern siren pack on lcpdfr.com. Alright dude, get out of my way. Uh, so if you want to download this siren, all you have to do is just go to lcpdfr.com and download that siren as you see fit, or any other siren. There's a whole bunch of other sirens like the uh, Wheelin 295, and um, there's the Federal Signal Touchmaster Delta. So, anyways, we're gonna be. Uh, it, this guy must be flying. It, it's taking me a while to catch up to him. Doing 130 mile an hour. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, see if we can't catch up here. We're gonna have to merge right. The lane ends here soon. Actually, we'll just stay in the middle lane. And we'll go ahead and reduce because we're at one traffic signal away. Ooh, okay. Almost wrecked it there. And they're driving a Primo. Dispatch calling unit 3, Charles 2. Dude, must Approach have been with flying. caution. Anyways. We're going to go ahead and stop him here. And maybe they're going to be. Oh, they're going to be stopping. Alright. All right, so we're going to go ahead and uh, open up our computer here. And we are going to uh, toggle our background and our pause. Now we're going to run this plate. Uh, okay, so the registration comes back valid. Insurance is valid. Uh, he is wanted, uh, as we suspected. He's been stopped two times. Oh, oh no, what's going on? What's going on? Oh, we're gonna have another one of these again, aren't we? No, por favor. Take it easy. All right. Get on your knees. Oh, he's got a knife. He's got a knife. And he's running. Assistance needed in Palato Bay. All right, well, I'm gonna go after this guy uh, for two reasons. One, because. Attention, oh. this is dispatch. Right, we are code four. No further units required. Alrighty then. I guess that just oh. Attention, unit one, Lincoln. Okay, AP. well we'll go ahead and we respond to this robbery. robbery in Palato Bay. Oh, I don't want to record. I'm already recording. So we'll go ahead and view the quickly view the statistics for this or the uh, call details. Reports of a robbery in progress. Weapons are involved. No current units currently on scene. Okay, so we'll go ahead and head over there. Code 3. So we'll try to get over there as quickly as we can. And uh, we're going to be arriving on scene here in a second. We're okay, shots fired. 
No, 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 no. Get on your knees. Oh, oh shots fired, shots fired, shots fired, shots fired. All right, we're still okay. Ah, uh, they've got. All right. We've got units requesting helicopters. Still got somebody in the bank. Or in the store. Charlie Four is airborne and headed to the scene. Eagle Six. Get on the ground now. Get on the ground. You move and I'll shoot. All right, he's complying at this time. And we're gonna we're gonna hop the. Uh, the counter here, and we're gonna place him in cuffs. LSPD, hands in the air now. And we're gonna go ahead and call for a transport. Backup required for a suspect placed under arrest in Palato Bay. I'm 10-8. Roger. Oh. We're gonna call for a transport, and they're gonna take over our investigation for us. Get in the car. No messing around. And it looks like they've been dropped off. One of the suspects has, rather. All right, so we're gonna be headed southbound Pyrite Avenue, heading on the U.S. Route One now. Gonna be eastbound. All right, looks like they're headed into the Cluck and Bell factory at this time. All right, and looks like we're gonna be going into the wrong way. We're gonna cut him off here. And All right, and successful. And get on your knees now. We got one uh, trying to escape up the hill. We're probably gonna have to call search and rescue for that guy. And we're gonna call for a prisoner transport on that Backup guy. Backup needed for a suspect placed under arrest in Mount Chiliad. Adam Six, copy. We'll check yeah. it out. Roger. Good day. You ain't worth the fucking steam off my piss. Alrighty. Alrighty, let's see if we can't uh, head this guy off. Oop, I just uh, damaged my vehicle. We're gonna we're gonna ride the train tracks here. There's really nothing I can do. I I can't uh, can't take my vehicle up there it's too steep I can't really take this vehicle severely off road so I guess what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna slowly get through here and we're gonna come down oh and I spun out that's why you don't take crown bigs off the road and we're gonna get back on the highway and see if we can't oh he might be coming down No, oh, he's not coming down. All right, let's see if we can't get down through here. Almost didn't make it. I can't seem to. Can't seem to see him. Can't tell where he's at. Back. Oh, I see him. I see him. All right, we're gonna take our vehicle back off road. All right, we're gonna we're gonna see if we can't uh, get him off. Oh, he fell. He just fell. He just fell. We got him. Hands up now. You get your crap. hands up right now. Don't even think about it. <laughs> all right, or he's just gonna go into the mountain. No big deal. All right, we got all three suspects in custody. Not too bad for getting shot up uh, about six times. Backup required for a suspect placed under arrest in All right, well, we're going to go ahead and we'll go ahead and put him in our vehicle. Get in the car. No messing around. I don't think this transport unit is going to be uh, coming up. Peace. I stand corrected. Okay. I guess they are. That works too. Son of a bitch. All right. Well, uh, we're gonna get down here. 
and visit a doctor. And we will be back on our patrol. Attention all units. Officer needs assistance in uh, Grapeseed. Alright, so we're going to head over to this uh, panic button crest in Grapeseed. Um, we'll go ahead and respond over here code 3 and see if this officer is okay. And we're going to be southbound Joe Lane. Uh, okay. I got here as fast as I could. What's going on? All under control now, thankfully. They're in the back of my car now. I didn't even see you. Their windows are blacked out. Okay, so what happened? They came at me so fast with a knife. Missed me about by about a couple inches. Damn, close one. Oh my goodness, all of the units just showed up on scene. Thanks for getting here so fast. Glad to know I have an officer. I'm going to assume that says sticking by my side, but I guess it's all the same. And she's just going to get out of his car like nothing happened. Alrighty. Well, we'll be back on our patrol. Man, look at that sunset. That looks beautiful. Dispatch calling unit 3, Charles 2. We have a traffic alert for a grand theft. Alright, so it looks like we're going to be taking an organized shoplifting call and PR hit. Dispatch calling oh, unit 3, Charles terminal. 2. Approach with caution. So we'll go ahead and flip around here. Alright, so we'll go ahead and uh, flip him and get ready to light him up. He's going to be northbound Marina Drive at this time. And is he going to be stopping or is he going to take off? Uh, it looks like, oh, pulling over. Okay. Let's pull him over a little bit more. Alright, and we're good. And just like before, we'll go ahead and uh, check our computer and validate that he is actually wanted and the insurance is valid. The registration is valid. Registered to a Colin McKay, 54 years of age. License is valid and is wanted. So we'll go ahead and request a backup unit. Although I'm not sure if they're going to be of any use or if they're just going to get out and then get back in. Alright, yep, no, this is going to be a code 5 stop. Alright, sir, go ahead and step out with your hands you up. And I'll shoot. I'm oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. As hell. Oh, shots fired, shots fired. Get shit. Uh. I'm switch over to my stun gun. Oh, I'm gonna go ahead and call for an ambulance. He took four bullets to the chest. All units, medical aid requested in Sandy Shores. Officers report an injured civilian. Dispatch units from. All right. Well, we got two suspects down. That was definitely a traffic stop gone bad. That's the second one we've had tonight. Fire truck is responding. Code three. Alright, so EMS is on scene. Attention, this is dispatch. No further units required. Proceed with patrol. So we're gonna go ahead and put our gun Give away. Some room. Lame ass. Oh, we got another ambulance on scene. And we've got a police car glitching through the map. Nice. Okay, well. Oh, Alright, well, she didn't make it, which is to be expected. She took about nine, ten bullets to the chest. I know it and means. he survived, so that's, that's good. I'm glad to see that he survived. Much appreciated. 
Attention unit three, Charles two. Citizens reporting a DUI in Sandy Shores. All right, so we'll go ahead and take that. Probably finish off our shift with that. Possibly impaired driver. Okay. No big deal. Uh, looks like he's going to be southbound Nyland Avenue. All units, code four. And it's going to be on this cheetah. Oh, yeah, he's definitely intoxicated. All right. Well, hopefully they don't take off from us. And we are going to wait until they turn the corner, and he just rolled the, through the stop bar. So we're going to go ahead and light him up. Yep, and they're going to abruptly stop. No big deal. We're going to pull him over here. Oop. All right. So we're going to go ahead and run their information, or at least their license plate. All right, so we've got uh, valid registration, valid insurance, registered to a Kurt Wright, 59 years of age, license is suspended, not wanted, stopped one time. Okay. So we'll go ahead and... Uh, We'll go ahead and ask uh, what his deal is. Good evening, I'm um, Deputy Lynch with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Reason for the stop is um, back there at the stop sign on Marina Drive and Joshua Road, you kind of rolled through that, um, and you seem kind of uh, all over the road. Can you can you tell me, have you, have you been uh, drinking anything tonight? Yes, got a problem with that. Um, it depends. You have anything illegal in your vehicle? That's none of your business. I know my rights. All right. Have you done any illegal drugs recently? I'm not obliged to answer that. All right. So at this time, I'm going to ask for your driver's license, registration, proof, insurance. Kiflaw. And this is Kurt Wright. So I'm going to have to ask you to step out of the vehicle, sir. Oh, go ahead. Let's go ahead and get out of the road here. All right. Jesus. Now at this time, oh, come on, stop. LSPD, hands in the air now. All right, that's fine. So at this time, because you are exhibiting signs of intoxication, I'm going to have to ask you to submit to a breathalyzer test. It's not anything difficult, and you don't have to study for it. Uh, all you have to do is just blow into this little tube and uh, for a couple seconds, and it'll let me know if you've been drinking or not. So if you go ahead and uh, blow it and uh, blow into this tube. Okay, you failed to provide a valid breath sample. So, at this time, I'm going to be charging you with uh, driving under the influence. Um, so, at this time, you will be uh, put into my vehicle. Dispatch. We are code four. No further uh, units required. I search you, of course. Maybe. Alright, I don't think it's going to want to let me search him today. Alright, well, it's not going to let me search him, so we're just going to go ahead and place him in our vehicle. Damn! Get in! And we're going to see if it'll let us search his vehicle. Citizens report an indecent and exposure. And it's not going to let us search his vehicle, so they'll get it back at the, uh, the impound lot. His vehicle will be. Uh, impounded at this time and uh, so it'll be towed away 
and we will write up an arrest report real quick and get this guy transported to jail and we'll probably end our patrol there. So let's go ahead and log in. So uh, Mr. Wright will be placed under arrest for I believe driving on a no nope, driving on a suspended license uh, is going to be a misdemeanor and he will be charged with driving under the influence and uh, let's see if we have any obstruction yep obstruction of justice so uh, he'll be charged for those and um, Actually, you know what? No. Instead of obstruction of justice. Attention unit 1, Lincoln 18. We've got a 10 I'm not sure if I want to do uh, concealing evidence Avenue. or obstruction of justice. Uh, let's do both of them. Why not? Roger, dispatch. We are so let's go ahead and uh, submit that. And he will be booked into jail for that. and we will take them back to the jail ourselves alright so we're gonna go ahead and pull up here and uh, Copy dispatch. get the uh, fine sergeant I guess our prison guard that's what he looks like uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, have him take our suspect and we will end our patrol there so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, feel, please feel free to leave me a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video.